At its core, high performance is focusing on being the best that you're capable of as consistently as you're capable of. And if I were to turn on the, the Warriors game tonight and watch Steph go crazy, he knocks down 12 threes, he scores 55 points, makes some unbelievable highlight moves. The average younger player wants to immediately go out to the court and emulate what they just saw Steph Curry do. The problem with that is they're skipping over, in his case, decades of practice that allowed him to be able to do it. They want to skip steps and jump right to his ability to dribble between his legs three times, shoot a fadeaway three-pointer. What they don't understand is for the last 25 years of his life, he is committed to mastery of the basic fundamentals during the unseen hours, and he has progressively built upon that to the point that he can now make that shot. That's the other reason that I don't think people tend to believe that it's easy because they want that outcome right now. They don't want to, wait, I have to, I have to work on my game for 20 years every day and make millions of shots in order to do that? I don't want to do all of that. I just want to be able to make that shot now. Everybody's heard that you have to work hard. We've all been taught that since we were really little. And everybody knows that you need to work smart, that you're doing the right things in the right way. But if you do those two things, but you don't do them consistently, if you only do them when you feel like it or when it's convenient in your life, then, then you have very little chance of, of reaching high performance. So yeah, the consistency piece is undervalued and underrated. You need to consistently show up in every area of your life. You know, the highest performers that I've been around, they didn't pick and choose when to be excellent or when to meet their standards. They did it in everything. You know, so so I know in my own life, you know, I, I aim for high performance as a father. I aim for high performance as a speaker, as an author, as a business owner, as a friend, as a member of my community. It's not something that I aim to pick and choose. You know, repetition is the oldest and most effective form of learning on the planet. And I don't think that's ever going to change. So the consistency comes into the fact that every single day presents us with opportunities to get in reps to practice reps at whatever it is that we're trying to work at. And it's my assertion that Stephen Curry will go down in history as the greatest shooter the game has ever seen. And I'm here to tell you all, it's not by luck. It's not by accident. It's not even because his dad played in the NBA. It's because he's willing to hold himself to an unparalleled standard. You don't need to come out of the gate with this unparalleled, almost unattainable standard. Yeah. Yep. You need to find for yourself what is an appropriate carrot to hold in front of your face and then incrementally over time continue to level that up.